Yo, what's going on guys? It's Dr. Schwarzer. Welcome back to another Gears 5 video. Today, I am going to be doing a quick guide on how to farm versus kills for the versus achievements. So let's get right into it. First thing you want to do is go into a versus lobby, uh, private versus lobby, and you want to set the map to river, and then the game mode to arcade deathmatch. And then you want to make sure you have these settings, so fill with bots on. Um, rounds to win as many as you want. Sometimes I do 10, 20, or 30, uh, depending on how long I want to farm. Round score 75, execution rules off, respawn time at 5, it's just the lowest it can be, and then DBNO time to down to 1. Um, you can do 2 or 3 seconds, that's fine as well. Uh, health regeneration, sometimes I put it on damage because occasionally the enemies will spawn, or the bots will spawn in the, the house with you. It's easy to get the edge on that, so, but normally I put it on normal. And that is pretty much everything I changed there. Health regen, normal. Uh, player damage, normal. Screen effects I like to mess with occasionally just because it's fun to mess around with the filters every now and then. Characters, so the if you're farming kills, you want to play... Benjamin or Cole. And if you want to do this on the Swarm team, uh, you have to play as Mira. One final thing, so once you have um, changed all your settings in the uh, game setup screen, you just want to lock all the slots on your team. So that's it's just a 1v5. And then you just start the match. So I'm just going to do that real quick. So once you load in, the change character screen will show up. Just press B, back out. Um, if you accidentally select a new character, just die and then change character and you'll be back to Cole or Benjamin, you'll be fine. So first thing you want to do is run straight into the house, cross. So what we want to do here is basically just stand in the, stand in the corner and have your chainsaw rift. You want to get at least six kills. Uh, you need six skulls to buy a boom shot, which will make this process a lot easier. So. Just rub your chainsaw, wait for him to come around the corner. Right, every time you get a kill, it's Cole or Benjamin. The arcade ultimate ability ability um, basically makes this fire show up, and uh, the bots will just keep walking into the fire. And they'll just do this the entire round. And you can get about 75 kills in 4 minutes, roughly. Uh, you want to be standing in the spot where I'm standing right here. So in the corner, against the wall in the corner, standing in cover without standing against the wall but not taking cover. Like if I'm sitting here uh, or here, see the enemies will shoot at me, um, or taking actual cover on the wall will slow the round down about, by about 30 seconds. Uh, so, so for efficiency standpoint, you want to stand in the corner to reduce any time that the enemy is going to waste trying to shoot at you. You just want them to start barging in the room over and over again so that they can just keep dying over and over again. You'll see here the round's about to end and see it's 3 minutes and 50. Eight seconds. Super efficient. If I get 75 kills in basically four minutes doing this method. It's you can also do it on blood drive, but it's I think it's more efficient on this map because you can hide in areas that reduce the bots ab being able to shoot at you while they run in. Um, so the second round, you can just start buying booms from the skulls that you have. Usually I'll buy one or two sets of ammo. Um, that's all you really need. Because once you start farming this for hours, you'll have plenty of ammo. And then you don't have to chainsaw anything to get the skulls. You already have enough. So just stand in the corner, boom shot, and then you kill you get with Cole or Benjamin or Mira, depending on the team. We'll create this fire, and uh, that is pretty much it. As you can see, uh, a little tracker is going to show up. So you see the little white bar that moved right just now? Every time that moves, you do 1% progress towards your achievement. See, it went from 70 to 71%. So every 1,000 kills I'd be getting, I'd be moving up 1%. So that's what I leave the tracker on there for, just to see roughly um, when, I, when I'm going to hit that next percentage. And that is pretty much it, guys. That's how you. That's a very efficient way to farm versus kills for the achievement. So you'll be able to easily farm two versus achievements here. There's the first one for 25,000 kills called Yep, I'd Say They're Dead. And then there's the one for 100,000 kills called Nothing But Bits. So just to conclude here, I'm just going to show my final match screen. So I did 30 rounds of arcade deathmatch on River. Um, that took me about 2 hours and 15 minutes to get 2,250 kills. Pretty efficient. Uh, 
Of course, to get 100,000 kills, this is going to be taking quite a while, but this is definitely the most efficient way to do it solo. Thank you all so much for watching, and there will be a video coming soon on how to farm versus assist and how to farm versus damage. Be on the lookout for that. Thank you all so much for watching. Peace.